back with American Latino TV presents History by Us. I'm Carolina Trejos. Up next, Mateo Kligman grew up with his eyes on the prize becoming an Olympic athlete. But after failing to qualify, Mateo turned to music. As a native to Macas, a region in Ecuador's Amazon region, Mateo developed a world where nature meets technology and modern sounds meet the folkloric beats of generations of native Amazonian tribes. He created a sound so unique, even Oscar and Grammy winner Gustavo Santolaya took notice. And we get a taste of it right here. It's Mateo Clickman on American Latino TV. Hi, I'm Mateo Kingman. Uh, I'm an Ecuadorian musician. I was born in Quito, uh, but I grew up in the Amazon because my parents they went to the Amazon to work in some conservation. And I grew up in this very special place that is, is very powerful and inspires you to do something. But I never realized that the thing was that I, I had to say something with some art, you know, about the Amazon. So then I started to write music, to write songs, and instantly it came about the day-to-day -day life in the Amazon, you know, the rivers, the forest, the things that we were living with my brothers and with me with my friends every day we did this first album that for me is like a literally painting of my life in, in the Amazon, you know. At the first time, we didn't know what to do with, with this idea about mixing uh, electronic music and traditional Ecuadorian music. My current album, Astro, is an experiment between traditional melodies from Latin America and the new contemporary urban music. When I started to do this album, I thought, how can I m extract some very precise elements from this new world for, for me uh, that, that I, I like and put into my, my real essence. Uh, well, I met Sa uh, Gustavo Santaolalla in, in Mexico. We had like a very special, we were in the very same energy, you know. When we connected in this, in this level, we were going to, to do something with music, you know. And then I sent him my music, the first demos, and he told me, okay, I don't know what, what we are going to do with this music, but I'm sure that I will produce or maybe we will do some collaboration, you know. And then it finished in a song that is called Ultimo Aliento the most important song in, in the album because it has like the whole idea of the album in one song. You know, I wasn't in the school because my parents, they decided not to put me in a traditional school. So I grew up in my house in homeschool. And in this way or, or studying or living, you do what you really want to do all the time, you know. And I think that is the, the most important thing about music for my solitary music, for my solitary moments in music. It, it's like the same thing that when, when I was young, you know do what I, I really want to do without limits. 